Hello and welcome to setting up your Windows 7 computer for use with your teleprompter. And for this demonstration we're going to be using a non-reversing monitor, the standard setup that you get with your teleprompter. We're going to begin by just right-clicking on the desktop. You can either go to Personalize, but the quickest way is to go into Screen Resolutions. Now when you first hook up your teleprompter to your computer, it's going to change your resolutions to be 1024 by 768, which is a good thing. But it's going to put you into clone displays where everything on the laptop is going to look the same as it does on the teleprompter. And what we want to do is change that here to be extended displays. And so you can click on identify. Your main computer will be one. And showing up in the teleprompter, you'll see a number two very quickly there. And you click on identify to check that. You can see that this is highlighted around the edges there. So I'm working on monitor number one. I'm changing the resolution to be 1024 by 768, if it's not that already. And then I'll click on number two and change that to be 1024 by 768, adjusting that slider. So both of these boxes are the same size. Now, I also need to set their color depth to be 16-bit. And I do that by going over to this Advanced Settings, and it's kind of hidden. And if you click over to the Monitors tab, it tells me what my refresh rate for the monitor is. And right now it tells me that I'm in 32-bit, and I want to make that to be 16-bit and I will click Apply. Windows will give me the warning. Uh, do you want to keep these display settings? And I'll tell it yes, and click OK and close that. And then I'll want to do the same for monitor number two. Over to the Advanced Settings, and the Monitor tab, and the Color Depth. Oh, it is already 16-bit. That's good. So I can just click OK and get back to this menu. I click OK there. Both of my monitors are now in 1024 by 768 at 16-bit in extended desktop. So now, if I launch FlipQ, I will check this box here that says Secondary Display, and I'll be sure to check the box next to it that is mirrored. And so that's the teleprompter, and I'm making it mirrored. Up to now, everything you've seen in the teleprompter has been reversed, but now when we go to start the teleprompter software, the output going to it is gonna be mirrored, so when you see it in the mirror, it will be correct. Hit the Launch button there. It does a little rendering and then starts scrolling from the bottom. And of course, it looks normal on my screen. And if I look at it in the teleprompter, it looks correct when I'm looking at it in the glass. And that is how you set up your computer, a Windows 7 machine, for use with FlipQ.